Hey guys, I hope you are doing well today. I wanted to share with you my TBR for the 21st round of Bout of Books. Now, I'm sure you guys know about Bout of Books, but just in case you don't, it is a super, super casual readathon in which the only real goal is to read as much as possible in a single week. They don't have specific reading challenges. They do have, um, like, Instagram challenges that you can do or photo challenges that you can do, but otherwise it is super, super relaxed. For that same reason, I think this is the perfect readathon to start off the year, just to kind of like ease you into things um, and let you be super casual and just have fun. I'm trying to be more realistic with my readathon at TBRs this year because I've been doing this for long enough. I know that realistically I will not read more than four or five books in a week. That's just, that's me at my absolute max, and I, I know I won't go beyond that. So I have four books that I'm going to be choosing from, though I have already started two of them. The first book on my TBR is um, I Am Malala, The Girl Who Stood Up For Education and Was Shot By The Taliban, obviously by Malala Yousafzai. Now I'm filming this video the Saturday before the readathon starts, and I am currently um, reading this, so if all goes well, I will have this mostly finished by the time Monday rolls around, but uh, I'm, I'm not quite sure on that, so I wanted to just add it on here anyways. The other book on my TBR that I'm already reading is an audiobook which has a very long title, so um, excuse the fact that I'm reading it, but it is 10% Happier, How I Tamed the Voice in My Head, Reduced Stress Without Losing My Edge, and Found Self-Help That Actually Works, A True Story by Dan Harris. Dan Harris is a news anchor who is also a huge proponent of meditation for stress relief, and I honestly can say that I wasn't interested in his books until last week when he went on The Daily Show and gave an interview about his most recent book. Now I put that one on hold at the library, but there is quite a long line for it, so in the meantime I thought I would go ahead and read his first book on Audible. So far I'm really enjoying it, mainly because he has a really dry and self-deprecating sense of humor, um, which generally is something I really enjoy. I actually stopped myself because I thought, you know what, I'm going to end up finishing this before the readathon, so I think this will be a good one to listen to once I go back to work more full-time next week. The only novel on my TBR is The Loney by Andrew Michael Hurley, and this is obviously a library copy. This is actually the second time I've checked it out, um, so I would really like to get to this one before I have to return it unread again, because I really hate doing that with books. And lastly, I have a short story collection on my TBR, which is The Beginning of the World and the Middle of the Night, of course, by Jen Campbell. Now, I'm really impressed that I have resisted the urge to pick this up so far um, so that I could finish a few things I was already in the middle of, but now um, I think this is my time. This, is the, this book's time to shine, and I'm really looking forward to getting to it. So that is my TBR for the 21st round of Bout of Books, and I honestly am feeling cautiously optimistic for this round. Generally speaking, I do better during Bout of Books than I do for any other readathon, simply because there is less, like, challenge specific pressure, so I'm hoping that I can finish the short story collection, finish Malala, finish the audiobook, and at least make some headway in the Loney. That's kind of how I think things are going to be going. If you guys are participating in the Battle Books Readathon and you would like to kind of sign up officially, I will link their website down in the description, but otherwise that is all I have for today's video, so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you are having a fantastic day, and I will see you next time. Bye!